What's happening boys and girls? Thanks for stopping back by another day here on the channel. We have got my buddy's 2018 Ram 1500 here and we're going to be doing a little bit of upfits for you in the way of headlights, headlight tint and see what kind of changes we can do to it. Do some uh, testing between the old style headlights as well as new style headlights and see what kind of lumen output we can get for you. So we got down here to Ironclad Tint located in Inglewood, Ohio. If you guys have any kind of needs of tint, uh, headlight work, they also do whole vehicle wraps, vinyls, uh, specialty stickers, and all that kind of stuff to help spruce up your vehicle, they do that kind of stuff. So we're going to go in here, we're going to talk to the owner and get his input on some of the headlights and we're, what we're going to do is we're going to do their specialty headlight tint on the vehicle today. We're also going to be working with the headlight manufacturer JDM Star, who I've done work with before on doing their latest greatest generation 8 of their headlight LED upgrades. We're going to get that one in the vehicle and then we're going to do some testing between how how bright the factory style headlights are to how bright the newer LEDs are and then compare that to when we do some tint on these new headlight assemblies also. So stay tuned we're gonna get this thing pulled apart and see how it's gonna look. Alright so now we're in here at Ironclad Tint we're gonna be talking with Chris the owner about just the different products on the headlight and the application of it as well as the Lux brand which is the actual tint that's going to be going on the headlights why you guys need to look into that one and how much better it is compared to what everybody else thinks that the actual headlight spray on film you get at advanced auto or whatever is going to be for you so let's talk to Chris and see what kind of info he has how's everybody doing my name is Chris I'm the owner of Ironclad Tent Company here in Inglewood Ohio um, today we're here with Kyle from Rust Belt Mechanic and we're going to be doing a little demo on Lux headlight and taillight tent. Uh, it's pretty cutting edge. Uh, the patented technology that they have is called air aggression which allows air to be released from behind the film so it's easier to contour to uh, the headlights and taillights when they're being installed. So gone are the days of getting night shades at AutoZone and spraying your headlights and your taillights and looking like a clown. Because now you can get into something that looks stock or looks like it's OEM and came that way from the dealership. And it's actually an aftermarket uh, product. So without further ado, we'll do a little sampling and then we'll get to the installation on this Ram truck. We're doing 18 Ram truck today, headlights, taillights, and fog lights. We're going to do it in the uh, mid-gloss smoke. So there are a few different uh, levels of VLT. The mid is a 24%, so it allows 24% of light through and, and obviously out from the lights. So as a certified installer and as an authorized dealer for Lux, uh, what we can offer is the only patented air grass film on the market. And Long story short, air grass was developed in the vinyl world. It is now transferred over with the technology into headlight and taillight tent. It allows the film to contour to compound curves, which is a game changer. Iron Man here is gonna basically be my prop to show you. So what we have here is a Lux piece of satin, and this is the mid-grade smoke. And what you do is you basically it's hard to see it, but there are hexagonal areas on the back that allow for, area to be, for air to be released. So basically what you can do is you can take something and you can apply it to a round surface, contoured, not using any heat, only force. And I can make that bad puppy go right around that curve. So there's a basic description on why Lux is different than everybody else on the market. Nobody else can do that. It's basically like taking a piece of paper over a basketball. That's every other product. And then there's Lux. So with that air aggression, another thing that's excellent is let's just say you do have a gigantic bubble that you did not lay down and it's trapped under the film. 
Air aggression allows you to softly massage the area. Boy, that sounded real uh, something, didn't it? But anyways, you massage the area and it releases it right through the hexagonal uh, directional pattern behind it. So if you get into a spot, you don't have to lift it completely back up in order to release the air. So Iron Man did his job and we showed you exactly what it does. And now you can see it's actually contoured to his head uh, because it wants to transform into the area uh, that it's applied. Now, one of the cool things about that air aggress technology is you see how it's all warped. If I take a heat gun to it and just wave it, it'll literally return itself right back to flat, just like it was when I pulled it off of this. But yeah, we're just gonna get into it and show you what it's all about. picked up a lumen meter off just a nice easy cheap one from Amazon it reads up to 2,000 lumens we're going to test the truck at about 15 to 20 feet out from the headlight beam source so let's roll over to that footage to see what our stock headlights are putting out all right so we've got everything zeroed out here on the lumen meter and we are located 20 feet out directly in line with our uh, beams of the truck. So let's go ahead and turn on the low beams. 509, 510 lumens. High beams, 1,110-ish, right around there. So those are the factory headlight bulbs. So not only with doing the tint on the headlights, we are upgrading the headlight bulbs themselves. And you guys have seen some videos before of us actually upgrading bulbs. And we are still again going with my good buddies over at JDM A-Star. The couple that we have going on is for the headlights, the high beams, we have 9005s. This is their NX series model. They're a fanless motor, fanless uh, unit, so you're not gonna have that amazing you know that annoying worrying sound going inside of your headlights they've got the fin design on the back as well as the modules there so you don't have that annoying headlight out warning on the newer vehicles and then for the low beams we have the newest 8th gen headlights here these are the h11s for the 2018 ram these things are absolutely amazing. They're rating at a 6,500K um, light source, the cool temperature to it. They run on the standard 12 volt source and I think these are gonna be some killer upgrades. Uh, their ZES chip is something that is newer to the market and I think that they're gonna look amazing on this ramp. So the guys are in there right now doing the tint on the headlights, so we're gonna tint one side and we're going to leave the other side blank to do a lumen count difference just between going from the stock headlights that we just showed you guys and then we are going to put these headlights in to see what the stock housings with the upgraded lights and then the upgraded lights with the new tint hopefully after we get this going we're going to have nice 
tinted headlights with the upgraded bulbs and we're still going to be over the factory lumen count that's the hope at least on top of being able to give this ram a sick look in the front end for the tinted headlight units all right so now we've got our headlights uh, put in with the newer 8th gen on both sides we've got our lumen reading and here it's not exactly dead you know light so we've got a little bit of ambient because it's not dark so we've got a 10 lumen difference in that one just from stock standing here so our right side we've got our upgraded bulbs and the left and this left side here we've got the upgraded bulbs with tint so let's go ahead and turn on the headlights so we find the middle of the beam middle of the beam right there we're at about 800 820 lumens on this side go ahead and hit high beams find the midpoint here we're about just over a thousand when we hit the midpoint on this side all right so now let's walk over to the other side turn the lights off all right low beams So we are actually maxing out the meter. Let me get off off cue here. 1950 lumens, and I can't even imagine hit the high beams and it's gonna. Yep, we're way off. We're gonna have to scoot back 10 or 15 feet to be able to get under 2,000 lumens. That's crazy, guys. Just getting you guys an overview of what the tint itself is gonna look like. This is your stock headlight housing still. All that chrome hanging out and with his specific truck having the nice blacked out wheels, all the dark trim and all, it's going to make a huge difference between the stock over to now our mid tint. God, that looks amazing. I love how that turned out. Not a single wrinkle in sight. That is one pretty piece of machinery. We even were able to, we had to pull the, the uh, stock fog lights out of the assemblies to be able to get in there because they are recessed in quite a bit, but we tinted those as well. Made a big difference there in the front end. So let's go ahead and get the other headlight tinted and we'll look at the uh, full overview once we get that one done. There we go guys, finished product right there. 24% tint on those lights. And they are crisp. That gives this truck a whole new look to it. And it's going to give you the same lumen count as what you had before on your factory. So there's nothing to really complain about that one. I love it. Absolutely love it. And then to boot, what we didn't show is let it scoot on over to the rear here because we tinted the rear too. The subtle mid tint of that 24, I think it looks absolutely awesome. I love it. I'm sure Alex is absolutely going to like it too. If you guys are interested in having any of this done also, Ironclad Tint Company over in Inglewood, Ohio, they are able to hook you up with any of your tint wrap, headlight, any kind of needs on those aspect. They do it. Chris does an amazing job. Give him a call. Well, boys and girls, that about does it for today. This project was something really fun. I really appreciate Chris dealing with us from Ironclad Tint Company. Like I said, if you guys have any of those tint needs, make sure you give him a call. We've got all kinds of really neat stuff coming up here on the channel. This coming weekend, we're going to be doing a collaboration with Truckmaster and HSP Diesel. We're going to be going up to HSP up in Michigan. Oh, I know, Michigan again, but that's how we do it. We're going to go up and uh, see how the HSP boys do a lot of their things, and we've got some really huge, I guess, secret stuff coming for the Duramax. So make sure you guys stay tuned to that one. If you haven't checked out already, toolheadscrate.com. That is the online subscription crate service where we are able to get you guys a monthly subscription crate box with tools, gift cards, coupon codes, did I say more tools? Yeah, more tools where you guys will be able to get that for you coming in at $35.99 a month, monthly subscription crate box. Make sure you guys check that one out. Make sure you hit that thumbs up, turn on the bell notification for when I come out with cool, awesome videos just like this one. Thanks again, and as always, you guys stay awesome.